In this tutorial, you're going to see how you can make four really fun dog toys, all just using one sock for each one and one or two basic supplies. Hello, and welcome to Fun Sock Creations. I'm so glad you're here. My name is Anna, and on this channel, you'll learn all kinds of DIY projects, all using socks. So let's get started on this tutorial. You'll need the following supplies. Head on over to FunSockCity.com for all your sock needs, including the ones you'll need for this project. For this first one, all you need is a sock. We'll start with a knot down at the very end by the toes. And then go just a little ways further and make another knot. And then again. If you can squeeze a couple more on there, that just makes it really fun. But it's pretty hard. And that's it. So to make this, you'll need one ball and one sock. You can recycle a ball that's not in terrible shape, or you could get a pack of two from the Dollar Tree. To start out with, you're going to tie a knot. You want to leave a little bit of space at the toe, so just do it right below the heel. Then slide the ball in. Then tie another knot right above that. Then tie another knot fairly close to this last knot that you tied. And we're just gonna make a few knots in here. We're gonna be tying these two ends together. So you wanna make sure you leave enough room to be able to do that. I don't think I have enough space to do another knot on either side. So now I'm just gonna bring these two ends together and tie them in a square knot. So that means if you go right over left, then you're gonna go left over right. And then pull that as tight as you can. That's toy number two. For this next toy, all you need is one sock and an old empty plastic water bottle. These ones are pretty flimsy, so it might not last as long. If you have one that's not quite as thin, that'd be great, but just use whatever you have. Shove it into your sock to about the heel, right here. And then tie a knot right below that. And then tie one or two knots above the water bottle. And done. For toy number four, you'll need one sock again. If you have an old worn out dog toy, you can cut it apart and get the squeaky bit inside of it and recycle that for this project, or you can actually order these on Amazon and we'll have a link to that in our description below. And you'll also need polyfill. So again, I like to have a knot towards the bottom to, so that you have something really good to grab onto, or the dog, too. It just adds one more element of grip. And then you're gonna stuff this with polyfill. And if you have multiple squeaky Things, that'd be fun to put them in there. You want to put this squeaky bit somewhere in the middle, not right on the edge, and then fill it up a little bit more with polyfill. If you do have more than one squeaky bit, you could have one here, and then you could tie another knot, do another bit, and tie a knot. And once you're all done filling, go ahead and knot it off, and you can add more knots, as always. And that is toy number four. Make sure you like the videos, share it with friends who may find it helpful. Also, don't forget to subscribe to our channel so that you don't miss any upcoming videos that you'd like to see. I hope you're outside enjoying the weather, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye. <laughs>